Rougarou Fest in Homa, Terrebonne Parish, is a lively celebration of Cajun folklore centered around the legendary swamp creature, the Rougarou. With vibrant parades and rich local traditions, this festival brings South Louisiana's culture to life while inspiring the community to protect its precious environmental heritage. Hey everyone, my name is Jonathan Foray. I'm the executive director of the South Louisiana Wetlands Discovery Center and the chairperson for the Rugaru Fest. And I'm here today to share with you something that is really pretty amazing. So at the festival, um, we produce a lot of trash. We do our best to make sure that um, everything is biodegradable. We try not to use any styrofoam, things like that. We use recyclable cans, but ultimately we end up with a lot of trash at the end of the event. We have over 45,000 people that attend over the weekend. So we produced about three tons of trash this year. Behind the fun, the South Louisiana Wetlands Discovery Center leads a deeper mission raising awareness about Louisiana's disappearing coast and the urgent threats of plastic pollution and global waste. This year, Phoenix Waste Solutions joins those efforts with a revolutionary new waste to energy technology. As a Louisiana company, we love SLWDC's mission to make the festival a zero waste event. To achieve zero waste, we have to understand the waste hierarchy. The first and most desirable step is to reduce how much waste is produced. Next is reusing our things as much as possible to avoid waste. Recycling is the next level. Public education is very important to make recycling successful. Even one person wish cycling can contaminate an entire batch of recyclables. For materials that cannot be recycled, the next level is to recover energy from waste as it is processed. The Phoenix enables communities to do this. The least preferred option is waste disposal in a landfill, or worst of all, dumping waste irresponsibly. We received three tons of waste from the Rigaroo Fest. The Phoenix thermally reduced that waste to the ash you see in this bag. We also recovered 10 bags of glass and aluminum cans which can be recycled. Best of all, we achieved this without burning any fossil fuels. The only inputs were our labor, 50 gallons of water, which was steamed off by the process, and electricity, which less than a small uh, air conditioner use. The Phoenix uses low temperature plasma to achieve temperatures of over 2,000 degrees Fahrenheit within the furnace chamber just using the waste feedstock. We don't burn any propane or diesel or natural gas. And 30 kilowatts of electricity can be co-generated, which can power up to 15 houses. Low temperature plasma also suppresses the pollutants that are produced from combustion so that the air emissions meet EPA standards. What added benefits you got? You got the ash. How do you capture the heat that's blowing off and turn that into an energy source? Now, we like to say that we are a zero waste festival, and so that's largely in part because we use biodegradable materials. But this year, Phoenix Waste Solution has stepped that up for us, and we are truly zero waste because this paver that I have with me here today represents the ash that was created from the three tons of trash produced by the Rugaru Fest this year in 2024. And so it, is, uh, it makes me feel really great to know that we can say that we truly are a zero waste festival with the help of Phoenix Waste Solutions. Thank you guys so much for your help on this.